My name is Hernan Jimenez. I am an actor, a comedian, and I also write and direct movies sometimes. This time I'm here to do an artist uh, residency to screen two of my older movies. And also just as a way to connect with community and, and Costa Rica to the Pacific Ocean, which is where one of those movies was actually set. Growing up, there wasn't really a lot of Costa Rican cinema. There wasn't Costa Rican stand-up. For a long time, I considered it a limitation, but at the same time, uh, the upside of that was that it gave me immense freedom. You know, this is where I'm from. It's saturated, it's alive, it's, it's loud, it's funny. Uh, some of it doesn't make sense. That has never really left me and I don't want it to leave me. And I, I in fact, I guess the older I get, the more I try to embrace it. Costa Rica always gets you in the door. Everybody always has either been here or knows someone who's been here. Yeah, it's a conversation starter and it's also a reminder of where I'm from and how much I owe to this country because I really do feel like I owe everything to a Costa Rican audience that has been extremely and beautifully loyal. There's another rather frustrating and if looked at from enough of a distance funny side to be asked for a couple of selfies at the airport in San Jose and then land in LA and be a complete unknown in LA and Hollywood. Nobody gives a shit who I am and <laughs> nobody will take my phone calls. When I write, I need to feel very alone, but I need to understand that I'm surrounded by life. I think that is precisely what uh, Nosara offers to me. Incredible amounts of independence and solitude. But to me, there's nothing more comforting than, you know, the sound of a restaurant in the distance. It makes me feel contained and protected, but it also offers um, a very intimate and very quiet and very alone space in order to write. I think that relationships are always bound to stir you up in such dramatic ways that they make for the perfect fuel to tell a story. And I think that the emotional stakes of human beings are just, you'd be hard pressed to find situations where they're any higher than when it comes to love. I think that it would be really, really interesting to come to a place like this that is so alive and so full of life and so oriented towards yoga and wellness and infuse it with something that could really, really challenge that. I haven't quite been able to crack it open yet and I, I, I really trust that one day it'll just kind of reveal itself. Uh, I try to be very patient with those things. Really what I would say is go out and make a movie. Perhaps the most important thing is you will learn a whole lot about yourself. Uh, you will learn about others, about friendship and about collaboration that will define whole aspects of your life. And it's what making movies is all about. Oh, this is Mia, come here Mia. This is a key partner in my creative process. She's a local celebrity here at Harmony. She knows her way around the place now and the second we get out of the car, she knows the exact path towards the beach. 